guys, how's it going? It's Height here, and we're back with a brand new first look to the channel, and this is Minecraft Feed the Beast Stone Block version 3. So, this is my world, I guess. I just started a new save. And I can't seem to... Oh, okay. I wasn't expecting there to be stuff already. So, uh, I can't interact with a lot of this stuff. I don't know. Can I burn? Yes and no. Hey, look! Chicken. All right. Well, don't mind if I do. What else is in here? Nothing. What's going on? Can I... What, what is going on here? Just a whole lot of nothing. Okay. Well, I'm not sure. I'm seeing that teleporter. I think we probably have to go in there. But before we do that, I just want to make sure... What in the heck are these guys? Drig me? Drig me. I can't hurt them. Okay. Good to know. What is this? Reanimated soul sand. Because I feel like every time I play modded Minecraft, I don't know what is a mod and what is vanilla. There's so many new things in regular vanilla Minecraft that I don't even know if I... I, I don't even know. That's that's for sure. I, I know I don't even know. Anyway, I don't think we're allowed to do anything here, so we have to kind of hop into this teleporter. And maybe it will take us... Stone block portal. It'll take us to our start. Feed the beast original. Cave. The drippy cave. The drippy cave. There's like little houses in there. Lushed house. Lushed mine shaft. Mine shaft intersection. I want one with the house. I think. I think I want to start with a house. Which leaves either this one or this one. And this one just looks better. <laughs> I don't know. I don't want to, like, I don't want to have too much stuff at the start. I kind of, I don't know. Let's just do it. Okay. So, I guess this is our house. And we can get some grass. I'm assuming cave vine plants. These things look like they're giving off light, so I'm a little bit glow berries. What the heck is a glow berry? Okay, hang on. Let me I can't do anything with this actually. How do I get into this house? Here we go. Oh, it's cute! Campfire? Uh, okay. Oh, we got some, oops. We got some barrels here. Oh, what's this? <gasps> Quest book. Welcome to Feed the Beast Stone Block 3, Introduction and Information. This mod pack is placed entirely with an underground world with no surface. As you travel further from your spawn point, you will come across dungeons, caves, and eventually a ring of nether and end. Okay. Uh, was I supposed to click that? Getting stone. Break some stone with your bare hand. Alone in a cave with nothing but rocks? What's a better use of your time than punching them? Mining stone with your fist results in dropping stone pebbles, which can be crafted into cobblestone. Can be eaten? If for whatever reason you want to? Uh, what? You can eat chunks of stone? That seems kind of weird. Why am I not... Oh, it is dropping stuff. Okay. Alright. I 
I don't know how many of these things we're gonna need. What's the quest book? Is there a quest book button? How do I... I guess I just have to keep using this book? Break book. Reward. Crafter tier 1. What the heck am I supposed to do with that? Without wood, make do with stone. Four cobblestone can be crafted into a crafting table. Uh, okay. So, cobblestone. Uh, we're gonna need a bunch more cobblestone. Okay, I think we got enough now. That should make us a crafting bench. Cool. And I guess for now, I'll just plunk it right here. Why not? Whoopsie daisy. There we go. Okay. So, can I make a whole bunch of cobblestone? I don't know if I want to make a whole bunch of cobblestone. Can we make sticks? Stone rod. Uh, okay, that's not how we make a pickaxe. Ah, oh, there's the quest button. Crafting table, get. Tape measure. Make a crook, make a hammer. How do I make a hammer? Okay, we were close. We were really close. So let's make a, oh, I don't have enough sticks yet. Or, or rods or whatever, whatever these are called. There, let's do that. Crushes materials down to their core components. I'm not totally sure this is what I need. Oh, wait. Oh, it's dropping cobblestone. Oh, that's perfect. Okay, so now we can get all the cobblestone we ever wanted. I don't know exactly where I want to start mining. But I guess this spot is as good a spot as any other spot for now. I don't know. I don't know. I don't think I like... What do I... Four? Let's just, let's just go five. Five by four. I'm assuming I'm gonna need a whole bunch of stone. This is stone block after all, so let me just mine up some stone here. And we can see what we can do after this. Okay, I do want to be a little bit careful that I don't end up making a spot for monsters to spawn. I might have already done that, actually. I might have screwed things up already. So, quest hammer down. Get got good. Lexic. Botania. All right. Make a chest. That seems easy enough. We should be able to make a... What the hell was that? What was that? Green candle. I don't know what that was, but it sounded like a creeper falling from the sky. <laughs> I got nervous. Wait, this is not a chest. I mean, I'm going to need a furnace too. But how do we make a chest? Cobblestone part? Oh. We need cobblestone parts. Alright, now we can start making chests, which is cool. And what do we do with those? Chest completed. We got a chocolate cake. The mod stone chest adds stones chest. Absolutely fascinating. All stone chests work identically to normal chests cool a wolo wait what is going on here we need gravel get gravel one compressed cobblestone turns into nine gravel is that what i'm understanding i think so let me see one compressed cobblestone coming right up and if I put this down, can I break it? Yes. Okay. And then I guess we have to do 
do that again? How many? I think we had to get a bunch of stuff, right? Sand. Oh, dirt. Cool. Let's keep going. See where this takes us. This one's probably sand, yes. And then what? Is clay... Clay is probably last. I would assume... Where are we at? Looks like clay. Oh, it's dust. Is that the last one? Good. Good. Good some more. Extra good. Andesite? Get andesite. If you mine either up or down far enough, you'll reach a layer of andesite. Beyond that is deep slate. And only then is there bedrock. Okay. Does it tell us what elevation we have to dig to or we just have to dig until we get there? What is that? Hello. Is that a normal Minecraft thing? What? Did it... Just give me a piece of iron? What is it doing? Yo. Wait, what is happening? <laughs> what is happening? This guy's just dropping all sorts of stuff. What? Where did he go? Oh, he should have tried to capture it. Where did he go? Oh, no. My free golden chicken. Well, I mean, he gave us a copper ingot, an emerald, 16,000 EMC, and some iron. I mean, that's pretty cool, but I don't know where he went. Anyway, uh, we were going to do andesite. Is there a way to make torches? Let's see. I want torches. All right, so I have no idea how to make torches right now. Treated stick, regular stick. I mean, we don't have... Unless I have to start growing bamboo. Oh, we can get bamboo from crooking sand? Is that right? Seems kind of weird, but let's let's try it. Let's see how this works. If we can crook some sand to get some sticks, then I should be able to make some torches so that we don't have to worry about monster spawning. I don't even know if monsters do spawn in this, but I would rather not find out right away. Okay, so now... Seeds quest? I'm assuming we get seeds just from hitting the grass, yeah? Getting all sorts of stuff here. Okay. And then... What did I say? Sand? I think I said sand. Let's... Let's try sand. I don't know. Oh my god, it does actually drop stuff. I don't think it dropped what I wanted it to, but it... It does drop stuff. All sorts of stuff. Look, we're getting bamboo! Okay. Well, it's not nice, but it works. So bamboo should get turned into sticks. One stick. One stick for... Oh my god. I don't know if that's actually worth it. Might not be worth it. Wolo. Improved pipe upgrade. What are the chances we just get some torches given to us here? Reward. Potatoes. Using your crook on dirt has a chance of dropping any of these seeds. Ah, I see. So we get to pick one. Potato. Potato. Wait, why isn't it letting us pick it? I'm not... I'm not sure what just happened. Get a sapling. Yeah, 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 this is what we want. From mining dirt with a crook. Okay, okay, okay. Uh, dirt. Dirt, 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 dirt. I know I have dirt. 
I need to start using this chest that I made because my pockets are full. Also, we have chests in here. Let's let's just put a lot of this random stuff that I don't even know what it's for right now. I don't need a tape measure. I don't need this. I don't need those. I definitely don't need Alexica Botania right now. Okay. That's that's getting there. That's better. What is this button for? Look at andesite? Oh, I kind of cheesed it because there's andesite in my base. Oops. I, I'm... We're not gonna... Oh, there's a map. Oh my gosh. Okay. What is... What is this? And this. Polished andesite. I like how it says that it's planes, but I don't think it, I don't think it is. Okay. Anyway, let me see if we can get some saplings out of all this dirt that we have. That would be great. And then we can start growing some wood. And then once we have wood, we can start making charcoal and start making some torches. Look at all these saplings. Oh my gosh. I love it. Okay, we got archwood. Can, can I? Come on. Grow, grow, grow. Grow, 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 grow. Maybe. Come on. Someone's got to grow. There we go. All right. Now we got wood. That's perfect. We can start making some torches, hopefully. So I should have some wood now. Yeah, we got 21 wood. I want to see if I can make an axe because I'm sick of punching this stuff with my hand steel axe wooden axe stone axe okay yeah so that still works that is still normal hang on i didn't look to see if if i had to use stone or not maybe it doesn't matter why am i breaking my wood apart Maybe it is wooden, wooden sticks. There we go. Now we've got a stone axe. Let's just chuck those for now. Okay. That should be good. And I, again, I don't know what to do with half this stuff. I got way too many vegetables and plants and all sorts of stuff. I actually want to keep those because we're going to farm some more. Okay, that looks good. Let's put this thing down somewhere for now. Uh, not, not there, please. Down here. All right, and then we should be able to make a little bit of charcoal. Whoop, come on. What? Why can't I split this? There we go. Okay, that should make us some charcoal, and I will just gather up a little bit more wood while we're waiting. And we can start a mine down to the andesite. Let's go. Okay, so now we have some charcoal, which is good. I hope we can make some torches with this. Yes. Great. Okay, now we have some torches. I'm a little bit nervous about this spot over here. So I'm just going to light it up just to make sure. And then I don't know where I want the tunnel to be that goes down. I probably am going to want a pickaxe, a proper pickaxe, at least one, maybe more. You know what? We could just turn this into our mine shaft for now. Why not? Right? Let's just let's just do it. Let's go down. Holy cow. Okay. Well, that is a lot deeper than I thought it was going to be. Where are we even? We're down at like minus 53 before we started finding andesite. I started making a nice big wide tunnel. And after two pickaxes or three pickaxes, I was like, you know what? Let me just see 
Let me just see how much farther I have to go. Well, we have to go a lot farther. Anyway, we've got the andesite here. I'm out of I'm out of stairs, but we have tons of cobblestone now, so we can make all sorts of stuff, which is great. But let's head back up to the top real quick. I want to make more stairs. And let's see here. Let's make some more stairs really quick. Something like that will do. Perfect. Now we've got tons and tons of stairs. Let's see what we have for quests here. Get sapling. We did that. Crafter tier one. Another crafter tier one. Get wood. 24 to 32 oak. Yeah, let's go with oak. Matches what we've already been farming. Tinker's tools. We can start doing tinker stuff. Never heard of a millstone. Millstone. Hold W to ponder. You can get basic resources like iron using the millstone. Uh, how? Do we do we put cobblestone in it? Or how do we actually get the iron back? Let's see. Iron. Enriched iron. That's probably not it. Iron dust. That's probably what we're looking for. Uh, I'm not seeing the thingamabob. Automated crafting. Crushing. Where do we just get iron from? Dirty iron dust? Okay. I'm not seeing it here. So dye, dye, sand, more dye, string. What is this? Wool die die it's all die okay we can mill saddles into leather that's kind of weird more die more die i don't know if this thing is actually that worth it we can mill andesite into cobblestone uh, more die more die Okay, more die, more die. Wait, what was this? Certus Quartz Dust, okay. Alright, well, it looks like a whole lot of nothing much. What's this? Slag or gravel we can turn into all sorts of stuff. Oh, raw iron. Okay, and then what do we do with this? Block of raw iron. Raw iron. Oh, okay, okay, okay. So we take the gravel, we put it through the sieve, and or the mill, or whatever the heck this thing is, and we can get back some raw iron, which can get turned directly into iron ingots. A robot. Oh my god, a robot. I don't think we have to worry about that anytime soon we don't even have power we have none of this stuff so okay let's start with a millstone hand crank cogwheel i'm assuming we're gonna need all of that stuff to get this going all right so millstone requires polished andesite and a cogwheel cogwheel requires polished andesite how do we get polished andesite oh just just four andesite. Do I have four andesite? We're gonna need more of this for sure. And some buttons. How do I make buttons again? I forget. Oh, right there. Okay, now we can make cogwheels. And once we have that, we need two more andesite. Another andesite and a wood. All right, I'm gonna need a bunch more andesite and you know what while I'm going down there While I'm going down there anyway Maybe I'll make uh oh we're all out of wood. No, we're not we're not out of wood Maybe I'll make a few more pickaxes. Okay, not not that many and We can finish clearing out that path hopefully I don't know how many more pickaxes I'm going to need. Quite a few. We'll get this going. 
And I can put some stairs in there at the same time. Yeah, this will work. What the heck was that noise? That was the weirdest thing I've ever heard. It sounded like a cricket mixed with the devil mixed with... I don't know, like a microwave or something. Something like that. That's a pretty good description of it anyway. But... We're down here at the bottom of the mine. I, again, I ran out of stairs, so we couldn't quite, we couldn't quite bring the stairs all the way down like I wanted to, but we got them down here a good way. I'm just trying to get a stack of andesite here real quick before we head ourselves back up to the top. I would like to make sure I have one full stack. I can't really hold much more. My pockets are pretty full right now so yeah anyway let me just finish gathering up this andesite real quick and we can start making that mill so i'm expecting i'm probably going to need more what is that a witch is she in my house? What? What is happening? What? <laughs> my... My wall is laughing? Is this thing making the noise? What? What is happening? What is going on? Oh my god, there's a witch in my house! <laughs> Hello? Are, are you a friendly witch? Uh -huh. Oh! I have a feeling she's not friendly. Um... Huh, what do I do? How do we deal with this? Do I have sand? I have... I have dust. I don't have any sand. Okay, hang on. Hang on a minute. We can fix this witch. We can fix her really good. You think you're so smart, don't you, witch? Huh? You think you're just the smartest little witch in town. Well, I'll have you know, I am smarter. And I am about to put you out of your misery of being trapped inside the wall of my house. Okay, well, let's deal with this. Let's see here. Uh, that should work. Let's make sure she... ...doesn't go up. There we go. Goodbye, witch. I'm sorry. It didn't have to be like this. She's not dead. She just moved over. Just die. What? What is happening? Why is this happening? Is she over there now? I'm gonna end up letting her out, aren't I? There. That'll fix her. And while she's suffocating, I need to make some more torches. We gotta, we gotta fix this. Holy cow! Just die! 
Oh. There she goes. All right. Well, now that that has been dealt with, we can go back to our mission. I was wondering what the heck that noise was. That was the strangest thing. Okay. Anyway, now that we have dealt with our little witch problem, let's see. What did I pick up? A mob soul? I don't think I need a mob soul right now. Okay. There we go. And I have so much cobblestone, actually. Let's ditch some of it. Maybe not that much. Let's keep some. There we go. Okay. Now, where were we? We made a cog, but we need a second cog for this. We also need some wood. Okay. And that should be easy enough to make here. We can make one of those. And we're going to need another cogwheel, I think, which is going to take some more buttons. Okay. And we're going to need one of these, which we're missing the polished andesite for. Okay, perfect. That should be everything we need. Let's make a crank. Now, let's see. It's been a while since I played Create. Our last world went corrupted before I could even get, like, halfway done it. So, it is what it is. Let's just stick this here. I think all I have to do is connect... Connect that there with a crank... Like that. Perfect. Okay. And then I'm looking for... Actually, we already have gravel. So I'm looking for gravel. If I throw the gravel in here. And we crank this for 10 million years. Does it... Does it... We got some sand. We got some raw zinc. Oh, we got some raw iron! Perfect! I guess we just have to crank this forever. Whoop, 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 whoop. I didn't mean to pull the gravel out. Oh, this is gonna take a while. How do I know when it's empty? I don't know. We're just gonna sit here for a bit and see how this goes. That makes you hungry! Okay, I was not prepared for that. Oh, we don't have a whole lot of food. Okay, well, maybe I shouldn't keep spinning that forever then, because I'm going to starve myself to death. Perhaps it's time to start looking at some sort of food. Um, can we make a hoe? I think we can make a hoe. And we're going to need more dirt. Yeah, we're going to need more dirt. So let's take this and turn it into dirt. I keep hitting shift to run. That's how long it's been since I played Minecraft. Okay, we got some dirt here. And I guess I can just kind of stick it over here for now. Get a nice little spot for it. I don't have any water, so that's going to be a problem, isn't it? Oh, no. Water. Cauldron. You can get water by right-clicking a cauldron with leaves or saplings. What? We need to get... Eight, se seven, two, four, six. We need to get seven iron to make water so that I can grow food. How the heck am I supposed to do that? We've only got three and I'm going to starve. Can I... <gasps> Wait. The game said we could eat these. Uh, What did that do? Slowness and hunger. 
I mean, you know, that's not bad. We could just eat stone for now. And I already learned this the hard way, but your hand has to be empty or you don't get anything for this. Okay, well, I guess that's what we're going to do then to get the iron that we need. Just eat rocks. <laughs> oh my god. I never even considered having to eat rocks to survive, but here we are. So I'm sitting here, spinning this thing, going, geez, you know what, I wish I could spin this thing faster. And I might be able to if we gear it down, or gear it up, I guess. I'm not sure how much torque the little Steve can do. But if we get a bigger gear... Um, which we can't do right now. If we make a bigger gear... I should be able to gear this down... Come on. And hopefully this will go faster. Let's see. I'm, I'm pretty sure that's faster. Now the only way to make it go even faster is... Oh, that's not going to work. We're going to need one more... We're going to need one more big gear. And I don't think I can make that right now, because what do I need? More buttons? We can make more buttons, that's not a problem. Okay, we make one more big gear. And we've already got the little gear. That should work. Now if I take this off, this is not going to look pretty. But hopefully it's functional. Now, if I put this on here, and we gear this down just a touch, hopefully... Oh, no. <laughs> Steve's not strong enough. It was worth a try. Well, okay. At least we geared it down one time. I think this one is already twice as fast as the other one. So, it, it should help. It should help us a little bit, at least double the speed. Oh, it's done! Okay, we got a whole bunch of coal. We got 20 raw iron. Now we're talking. Okay, we'll actually use this coal first. Put the raw iron in. We'll get the charcoal out. Get it out of our inventory, and then we can start using the coal for stuff. I don't know what we do with the zinc yet, but this... Once it's done smelting, should allow us to make the cauldron. And once we have that, and we don't have leaves yet. Um, how do we get leaves? What else did it say? It said something else. Leaves or... Whoop, 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 whoop. Or saplings. Saplings we do have. So that will be perfectly fine. Yes, that is going to be great. Let's go grab some of those. Uh, saplings. We could use oak for now. Once we have two waters... Oh, we need a bucket as well. So we're going to need seven to make a cauldron. And then three more to make a bucket. And then once we have that... We will have ourselves an infinite water source. I don't know where to put it right now. Um, where do I want to put my infinite water? Just... Let's just stick it right here. Just for now. Just to get something going. We can move it later. The first seven. Make ourselves a cauldron. And do I have to put fire under here? Pro probably, yeah. Oh, there's a cauldron right... Right... Mm, okay, well... I mean... Oh, look at that. Okay, well... There we go. Now we have our infinite water. I just need three more to make a bucket. I should have paid more attention to what was going... There's another cauldron right there. We have so many cauldrons. Water. Get. There we go. Can I put this back in there? Perfect. 
Just to make sure we don't accidentally use up all of our water and have to do all that again. And I'm going to put a little spot right here. Boop. There we go. Now we just need a hoe. Uh, can we make a hoe? We sure can. Uh oh, my pockets are so full. I hate this. The problem is at the start of any mod pack, you don't know what resources you need and what resources you don't need. So you kind of just end up keeping everything. And then by the time you're done, half of it's just useless anyway, but you didn't want to get rid of it. Okay, there we go. Let's get this tree out of the way. Get this out of the way. Perfect. Now we can start planting some stuff. And I don't know what I have for seeds. We've got beets. Potatoes are always nice. Industrial hemp. I could grow wheat. Well, we, let's grow a little bit of wheat and a little bit of potatoes. We don't have any carrots. Oh, wait. Melons. Hmm. We don't have carrots. I could just eat this apple. Except my food is full, so I can't just eat this apple. Okay, let's just get this started. No better place to start than here. Why can't I put this down? Is it too dark? Might be too dark. How about now? There we go. We're doing it. We're doing it. Okay, guys. So I think we're going to wrap this episode up right there. We did pretty decent today. We got a lot done. There we go. We have some sort of, well, it's not really automatic, but we can print out more iron, more zinc, stuff like this. And speaking of zinc, let's actually do that. There we go. And we've got ourselves an andesite farm. And we got ourselves a stove, and we got ourselves three cauldrons now, and we only needed one. Oh, four. Make that four. What else is in here? A bed? Welcome to mine together. I don't think I want to do that. Interesting. Very interesting. Okay, well, like I was saying, guys, we're going to wrap this episode up there. I hope you are liking the first look here at Stone Block 3. If you want to check it out, it is on the Feed the Beast launcher available on their website. Go ahead, check that out, download that, install it. Can't go wrong. It's going to be fun. It's going to be awesome. We could do it together. So, anyway, I hope you guys are liking it. If you are, don't forget to leave me a thumbs up on this video. Subscribe to my channel if you're new here. And I will see you next time.